Hello, my name is Jared Van Heel. This is Martin from Cloud9 and Judas from the last days of Judas Iscariot. So I lost my erection last night, not because I'm not prepared to talk. It, it, it's, it's just that taking in technical information is a different part of the brain. And also, I don't like to feel like you do it better to yourself. I have read the Hyde Report. I do know that women have to learn to get their pleasure, in spite of our clumsy attempts at expressing our undying devotion and ecstasy, and that what we spent our adolescence thinking was an animal urge we have to suppress is, in fact, a fine art we have to acquire. I I'm not like whatever percentage of American men have become impotent as a direct result of women's liberation, which I am totally in favor of. More, I sometimes think, than you are yourself. Nor am I one of your villains who sticks it in, bangs away, and then falls asleep. That My one aim is to give you pleasure. My one aim is to give you rolling orgasms like I do other women. So why don't you have them? My analysis, for what it's worth, is that in spite of all my efforts, you still feel dominated by me. I'll tell you what I know. I watched you trip over your own dusty feet to heal the sick, the blind, the lame, the unclean, any two-bit stranger stub their fucking toe. Some lowly, distant relative too cheap to buy enough wine for his own fucking wedding suddenly runs out of booze. No problem, you just presto change -o! And it was fucking Miller time in O'Canaan again, wasn't it, bro? But when I needed you, where were you, huh? You forgave Peter and bullshit Thomas. You knocked Paul of Tarsus off a horse. You raised Lazarus from the fucking dead. But me, me, your, your, your heart? What about me? What about me, Jesus? Huh? You just, you... I made a mistake. If that was wrong, then you should have told me. And if a broken heart wasn't sufficient reason to hang, then you should have told me that too! Well, all I know is that you broke me unfixable. You want to know when you delivered your message differently? At the temple, Jesus, that's when. And you were beautiful there, and you left there three inches taller, and we all saw it. I loved you, Jesus. That's all I did. And that's the truth. And now I'm here. Thank you.